know I look a little crazy right now, but I want to tell you guys that I do these cleanings. Most of the cleanings I did were with my children being present. I wouldn't recommend it, but I didn't let it stop me. Two, I have already three different contacts, two companies that have multiple Airbnbs that I've been cleaning, and one person that is residential cleaning. I want you to know that you can do this too. Don't let your children stop you, you not having a babysitter stop you, being a single parent stop you, not having a car stop you, okay? Face thing that has helped me through this journey of starting an Airbnb cleaning service. Although we do do different cleaning services, I am more focused on having a cleaning services. But I just wanna tell you guys, before you will continue to watch the rest of this video, that it's not what you know, it's who you know. So I basically made these contacts and with bigger companies who have multiple Airbnbs. So not just one or two people that got maybe two Airbnbs, but over a certain amount of properties. I'm just letting you guys know that you can do it too. Don't let it stop you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, The Hustle Network. In today's video, um, I started Airbnb cleaning, yes. Um, I have been doing Airbnb cleaning for a while and I'm really excited um, because it's been going really, really well. So this place that we're in now is a five bedroom, uh, two bath with two kitchens. So we're just gonna be cleaning up and I will get into detail of, you know, how everything got started, etc. But right now I gotta get this bed done. part of the video I just want to tell you guys a little bit of information so that way you guys are aware of everything on how I got through this process how I started and how I was obtained up uh, how I ended up obtaining these uh, clients of mine so I'm gonna go ahead and get in a little bit about this so like I mentioned before I got this uh, whole Airbnb cleaning residential cleaning from watching a video on YouTube uh, from the user Upflip. He has a video of Crystal Ball talking about how he started a cleaning company with his wife and how Airbnb has been very profitable because they also do um, laundry, etc. So I was really intrigued. I've always been scared of doing, I've always been kind of scared of doing residential just because I feel like people are a little bit more very picky. So I decided that I was going to use Facebook, Thumbtack, um, Yelp, and Google My Business. First things first, before anything, I went to Canva. Um, I came up with a catchy name and uh, a logo for myself of who I was going to now represent as my company. Basically a logo and what I was going to call my company. So I just decided to open up a whole new entity and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna start fresh. This is gonna be for Airbnb and residential. And maybe if commercial also, but, so I was like, you know what, this is what I'm gonna do. So I first, so I ended up doing Google My Business and of course, if you know how Google My Business works, you put in all your information, they end up sending you the code to your house about a week later, you put in that info and then you're listed on Google. 
So in the meantime, while I was waiting on that, I made sure to make a Yelp. I did a thumbtack and a Facebook. So I did a Facebook page and now thumbtack, they do charge you for leads. So when I first signed up, they weren't asking me to pay anything because I had already put my card on file. But this time I didn't want to put out any money. I needed to see what results I was going to get without any money. So I was in the negative. I think it was like negative $11 for responding to this guy. And um, a negative $11 for two people I responded to. One was for residential. She, she was moving into a home and she needed it clean. I actually got to her too late. I got to an hour later and she had already found somebody. And I'm like, damn it, I need to be fast and responsive. So another lead comes in and it's a guy, he's saying that he just needs a basic clean every two weeks. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna tell him 60. And I'm just not even really thinking, I'm just responding quick enough so that way I can maybe get something. So I made a Yelp and then um, Facebook page of course. And from there, I'm just researching how to get Airbnb cleans, okay? And in the meantime, of before that, I was calling 50 places a day. So my daughter would be on the phone. I would be on the phone. Um, we'd be calling between 20 and 50 places a day asking if they're looking for cleaning services. Now, of course, that is really hard doing the cold calling because I feel like if they were looking for your services, they would be reaching out. But then also maybe down the line they will find a comp i mean are going to be in need of cleaning services so i'm like you know what let me download airbnb so i downloaded airbnb and i'm trying to tell everyone hey if you are in need of turnovers i'm available i kept getting no 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 and then all of a sudden they stopped me from messaging people because airbnb is not for that i'm like man so how do i find airbnb people who are looking for turnovers i looked on a video on youtube and she was saying you need to reach out to people on Facebook. So from there, I literally just started putting Airbnb uh, Michigan groups, Airbnb California groups, Airbnb Texas groups. You guys, that is what changed the game, literally. Before I get into that, I'm gonna tell you that I did spend $11 on Canva and I was like, you know what, let me get some cards because in the meantime, I'm gonna stop by and leave my cards by. Paid $11 for my cars from Canva. And I said, you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna get on Facebook. So from Facebook, literally moments later, I'm not even kidding you guys. There was a guy who left a message on the post I made and said, hey Raylan. Um, he said, hey Raylan, I have over 50 properties in Southeast Michigan. My assistant will be calling you tomorrow. And I'm like, oh my God, over fit. And I'm thinking, it could this be real? So I'm looking up the place that he said that it's from. He, he, he mentioned the company. And I look it up and I'm like, oh, okay, this really is legit. A day passed by, she didn't call. The next day passed, I had got a missed phone call. And I'm like, damn, okay. I don't know who this is, but let's see. It was her. She told me that they have 60 properties in Southeast Michigan and, um, that she would want to try me out it's gonna be a tryout basis so she scheduled me for like a week and a half out and i'm i'm like okay i got time to prepare to prepare for this literally the next day the guy from thumbtack responded and said hey are you able to do the clean i would like to hire you he left me his phone number i'm like oh my god this is working so he's like hey i need someone on tuesday at 6 45 in the morning and i'm like Oh shoot, that's really early. Heck yeah, I'm gonna make it happen. So the next day I did his property. I mean, I did his studio, really small studio. I took the cleaning supplies I do for the commercial cleaning that I do and some from home. I did learn from after that cleaning the things that I actually did need, okay? But he asked for a basic clean, which I did more than a basic clean and he was really happy. He left a thumbtack review and I actually just cleaned his house yesterday because yesterday was Tuesday. And this time I implemented, hey, if you want me to throw your sheets in there and your blankets, I totally can while I'm cleaning your home. Literally small studio can get cleaned literally in two hours. Probably really less than that, but I just take my time. And I'm like, oh my God. So I got my first 60 bucks in cash and I'm like, thank God. Now I need to reinvest this money. So I did take 60 of that and I took um, about $30 of mine. 
I ended up getting car magnets because when I pull up to the person's house, I want them to know that I, I definitely got the car magnets and I got four yard signs. And one of them's already been taken down at the grocery store, but that's okay. And I ended up putting out those. And I was like, you know what? I invested in my own dollars of getting two aprons, one for myself, one for my daughter, and a whole bunch of cleaning supplies, which will be in another video of what you guys are gonna actually need. Now, this is where the fun part starts. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna see if I can get something in California. I did. Off a of Facebook post, this lady had said, hey Raylan, I'm gonna be reaching out to you. And it took her like a good four or five days before she reached out. She finally reached out and I literally put an Indeed, um, uh, let's see, like an Indeed thing where you're looking for employees and I had over 12 people respond and I found a lady on there who said she does Airbnb turnover I'm like that's my girl like I need her because she knows what this industry is about I end up hiring her I mean I ended up hiring her I didn't take anything from the job because I had did a low price I said 65 I told her I usually take 20% but I wanted her to see that it really wasn't about the money it was more so about if she did a good job we continue to do work we would continue to do work. The lady said she did a great job and then she, every time that she had this turnover, she'd like her to be able to clean it. I was like, yes. Now keep in mind, this is like, it's been a full, I wanna say a full on three weeks total that this has happened. So just a week ago, yeah? Just a week ago, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make some more Facebook posts. I literally put a Facebook post in Detroit, Michigan, and I woke up the next day, not thinking I was even gonna get a response. I woke up the next day, dropped my daughter off at school, and I was like, oh, I got a message on Facebook. It was a guy who was saying, hey, Raylan, we are from so-and-so company. We're looking for someone to do cleaning. Can you call me? And I read it so fast, but I was so tired. I was thinking, okay, maybe he needs his church cleaned up. And I had pulled over at Duncan and I read it again and he's like, can you talk now? And I'm like, yeah. He calls me, tells me to do air, he does Airbnb turnovers if I can, if, if I'm able to do those. I've already done you guys a job on Saturday, two on Sunday, two on Monday. And what's today? Yesterday was Tuesday. So I didn't do any Airbnb turnovers, that was residential. I've already done, he literally hooked me up, he was like, I'm gonna send you my invite to my schedule and literally like the next day when I was on the with hanging out with my sister-in-law on this ladies night out my phone was going off and I had all these bookings now mind you when I told you guys the person with the other property with the 60 properties they wanted to do a tryout right so I ended up doing their tryout I learned a lot what I needed I learned some DIY things and they I asked them for the feedback and they said, hey Raylan, you did such a great job. We're gonna go ahead and add you on to our other stuff. You guys, this all happened from me posting on Facebook, letting them know who I was, what we do, what we offer, and if they are in need to contact me. Facebook, I would have to say, has been overall the best thing that I've used. Facebook. And when I tell you, I was so surprised because I'm like, wow. Facebook, but literally people are using Facebook like crazy. Just like you, we think that Instagram is being used so much, Facebook is actually being used hell of a lot too. And I was just so, so happy and excited. And I was like, man, I can't believe this. So we are now on finishing up our, I think this is the beginning of week three. I truly want to say it's been a lot, you guys. I will insert some pictures like here. My daughters were waiting there while I was doing the Airbnb cleans. Um, it's just been so much. Uh, so, okay. It's just been a lot. I just basically want to tell you guys that you can do this too. I literally was motivated and intrigued by this man's video. And I said, I can do that too. Down the line, I do want to turn this into more of a market, not a marketplace. I do want to turn this into what I do with my moving, where I'm not physically at that location, just like I did in California, but I make a certain percentage off of each thing. 
Now it may be pennies, but all of it adds up when I get a whole bunch of different places and tons of locations. I'm super excited. I want you guys to know that Facebook Marketplace is, Facebook is what helped me. I think that you should, when you get your earnings to make sure that you reinvest. Like I've had, um, I got money paid yesterday from the residential guy. I haven't really put too much effort in residential because I'm where Airbnb's at right now. And I put that money back and I bought some cast aisle soap. I think that's how you say it for mopping because I heard it shines up the floors. I got me a whole stack of microfiber towels. Um, right now I'm making about 175 a day for about four days a week. Um, so I'm, I'm super excited. I, I really am super excited and I love Airbnb cleaning because the places aren't as picky and if you do a good job, you're gonna continue to get more work. It's fast, it's easy, and I love it because you're not having to do a whole, whole lot that you would expect to do. It's more so of washing the bedding, um, cleaning up the mess they made and making it look really good for the next person, the next guest that is gonna stay there. I'm super excited. Um, and the clip that you've seen prior to this was just a video that I was kind of cleaning up a bit. But I just want to tell you guys that you can do this too. I never even thought about doing this. I've mentioned before that I don't like cleaning. But now I feel really satisfied after cleaning an Airbnb. And I just want you guys to know that you need to get out there because there is money to be made. Thank you guys for watching more. Uh, thank you guys for tuning into the Hustle Network. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I hope you guys get out there and get your hustle on.